In half a mile, use the right two lanes Look, to take the one way to Look at this one. Have a me day, you know? This is what I'm calling my me day. They look just like the Lululemon belt bags. Well, I'll put these tabs in there. I love them. They're so pretty. We about to go home for real. So tonight we are having jambalaya, something quick and easy. That was two and a half cups of water.
I actually just made some broccoli to go with the meal and it was real quick. I just put it in the stove. Um, but yeah, this is our dinner for tonight. Hey guys, we are about to go run some errands. Today is a little me day. So remember I told y'all about the, um, the pottery slash painting thing that I wanted to do. So we're about to do that. Let me show you my OOTD. Um, regular t-shirt. Y'all remember this shirt that I showed y'all in the last vlog. It's the Target upside down smiley face. And I have my new chanel -y to match. Cute little, because it matches perfectly, like perfectly. And then I have on these jeans. I think I got these from, oh dang, I forgot where I got these from. I've had these for a couple of years, but just some, they're called mom jeans, distressed mom jeans. And then these sneakers I got from Express a couple of years ago. So something casual, you know, and the purse just made the outfit because the smiley face, like the color of the smiley face in the bag itself. It's like perfect, so let's go. All right, so we made it in here. I think I'm supposed to just select, well, it did say, I just select an item and then you're supposed to bring it up to the counter, so. Since I'm just painting today, I get to just pick whatever I want. What do we want to paint? I don't know. They have plates. We can do a plate. I don't think I want to paint a plate though. And then, I like that teapot. I like that mug with the heart. For some reason, I like the hearts. Mm, I don't know. And over here, it's like little small. These are really small over here. And then over here, all right, this is the last little corner. So I think, I honestly feel like I wanna get the, um, the, um, the heart. Hold on, let me turn you guys around. I think I want to go for the heart mug. So we're just gonna probably get the one. Ooh, they have this one. This one has more hearts on it. It's cute. You can probably put like makeup brushes in it. Or it's between that one or the tea set. I really wouldn't even want to paint the plate though. That's the thing. But this is cute. Ooh, they have. Look, look at this one. Okay, it's between these two right here. This one's actually cuter. More detail. Okay, let's do this one. This will be cute. Yeah, let's do this. Have you been with us before, ma'am? No, this is my first time. Gotcha. So the way it works is the price on the bottom is everything. There's no extra fees, nothing like that. Okay. So it's going to take you, get it washed off with some water and get it ready for you. Okay. okay. Uh, you can pick anywhere you like, and then just uh, once you're ready, just wash your hands. Okay. I'll wash my hands first. They have like
like the color wall right here. And so select your colors from the tiles. Paint bottles do not reflect the true color of the paint. I like something like this. 20 or 54. Oh, let's do 201. Does that, is that glitter? Are these like glitter or is it just paint splatter on there? Um, it's it's actually uh, speckled paint inside. So it's not like glitter or it doesn't like illuminate or like shine or anything like that. Uh -huh. It's just a uh, speckled inside. So oh. the paint itself actually has like all the dots and everything inside. Okay. It's just a, a speckled version of the same paint. So let's say 216 and 16 are the exact same color shade of white. Uh -huh. Just one's got the spots inside. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You ready to pick out some colors? Yeah. Cool. So, the way it works is basically I'm just gonna hand it to you and everything is unlimited. Help us up to as much as you like. There's no limitations oh, okay. to anything. So I hand it to you. I just squirt them in there. Yes, ma'am. So okay. just like basically, um, just like big bottles of ketchup, just give one uh -huh. good shake, pour right inside the wells. Mm -hmm. um, there is no limit to the number of wells, the number of colors, paintbrushes, or paintbrushes, sorry, and the tools and everything is unlimited to help us up to as much as you like. Okay. Um, but the way of the paint works. So each one of these is the finished product color. Why mm -hmm. you guys are painting is gonna look a little different. Just like 12 will look like this at first, mm -hmm. but it'll actually fire into this one after you get it back after seven days. Oh, So wow. they will okay. change drastically. So playing from the tiles, just ignore the bottles. Gotcha. Okay, okay. And uh, each one of these tiles is about four or five coats of paint. So the more coats you add, the less transparent it'll be. So same number 12 and everything. So this is just four and five coats, but mm -hmm. on the back is one. Okay, okay. So really you're just kind of battling the transparency. Four and five just covers your bases. Mm -hmm. If you go any higher than that, let's say you lose track of time, you do like eight coats, you're not mm -hmm. going to hurt it. It's just going to guarantee it. Okay, awesome. Okay, these are the colors I picked. You can kind of see the color story and we're gonna go ahead and paint. Okay, so I think I'm gonna put the speckled paint, which is the lighter pink. I'm gonna put it all over the mug. And then the darker pink, I kinda wanna put it inside. And then the, I'm either gonna do the white or the light tan for the heart. So let's start with the inside. Wait, I need to get the brushes. I just grabbed like five different brushes. I need options. Y'all know I like options. I honestly feel like painting inside of the mug will be the first thing I need to do so I won't mess anything up. So I'm going to do the dark pink first and we're just going to paint it inside. Ooh, that's pretty. It actually matches my outfit. It matches. I should have got more of this pink. No, the camera is overheating. Okay, let me turn y'all off for a little bit. Okay, y'all, this is looking so good. Okay, it's gonna look light at first, but once it dries down, but can y'all see the speckles? Look how pretty that looks. Yeah, I'm doing the entire outside of the mug in the speckled paint, except for the heart. But it's coming out so cute. 
I'm excited. I'm excited. I think with this one, I probably just need one layer of, oh crap, I hit the heart. That's okay, I'm going over. That's probably what this is for, to wipe it, I think. No? Yeah? Okay. Gotta be careful when I get to the front. When I tell you this is so therapeutic, if you have anything like this nearby, I would Google it. Just I typed in um, painting near me or like pottery near me and I found a couple of locations. You don't even have to, you know, it doesn't even have to be a group thing. Just have a me day, you know? This is what I'm calling my me day. And just do something for yourself, something relaxing, entertaining. And this is definitely entertaining for me and relaxing at the same time. I had just enough. I don't know y'all, should I go over it? Well, he did say if I go over it with more than one coat, it is gonna, it'll be darker. I mean, it's supposed to dry darker anyway. I don't know, maybe I do need one more coat because it's looking a little skinny. Let me go get some more paint. All right, here we are with the outside of it. Now we just gotta get the heart. Oh, I missed a spot over here. How does it look y'all she is cute I need to get the rim I think I want to do the same color on the rim now the heart I'm gonna use this really tiny brush to go around the edges so I won't mess it up and then I'm gonna take a bigger brush to just fill it in Honestly, I could have just left this plain because it's white. Oh well, we already started it, so might as well finish. Thank you. No problem, you have a great day. Alright, thanks, you too. In half a mile, use the right two lanes oh, to take up my fire. Yeah. How am I supposed to tell you? I don't wanna see you with nobody guess me. Girl, guess where we at? not at Target, but we are at Walmart. I want to see what they have in store because I haven't been in here in a while. So we're just going to see. We're going to browse around, waste a little time because um, I finished pretty early in that uh, pottery class. So we're going to browse around, see what I can find. And because I do need to get a few things in here anyway for a video um, coming up. But I also just want to see what they have because I haven't been in here in a while. I am sweating. I just turned the AC off. It's hot. So let's go. Can I get a bucket even though we don't need anything? So, yeah. Okay. Oh, I'm so oh, this buggy is loud. Look, y'all, they have belt bags. They look just like the Lululemon belt bags. That's cute. That's a pretty color. This is cute. These are actually really, really cute. And they got a little weight to them, too. Girl.
Even when it's down to the wire, baby. Even when it's down to the wire. And it's looking good. Today I woke up and decided to get my nails done. We are about to go in there right now and get them done. They haven't really grown out that much, but I want them to be shorter and I kind of just want a full fresh set. Um, so yeah, I just felt like getting my nails done today. So that's what we're about to do. So let's go. Hello. I just want to uh, just a, um, soak these off in a full set. Walking out with no nails. Let me tell you about it. Yeah, so I go in there and I tell them that I want a fresh set because usually when I have my sets on for so long, I want to get them taken off and get a new set. So they sat me down and um, the person that was going to be doing my nails, he, um, he started peeling my nails off and one time i had the worst experience with um one of the nail techs peeling the freaking nails off um but anyway he started doing that i was like no no no, no. i want them to be soaked and he um he was like i show you i show you what i do i said okay okay um so he continues to freaking peel my nail off and i said no that hurts can you please soak my nails when i tell you this man got an attitude this man got to add to I said, you know what? Can you please just soak my nails? And I'm not, I'm not going to get my nails done here. I'm sorry. I'm not, well, no, I'm not sorry. But I'm not going to get my nails done here. Can you just soak my nails off? Okay, okay. It takes a long time to... I know. I know it does. I know the process. I know. Piss me off. Because he didn't want to sit there and wait for my nails to soak off. Because he thinks it just takes so long. I got these sandals I want to show y'all when I get home. They just got delivered. Mmm. But that pissed me off, y'all. I am pissed off, okay? I'm, ugh, my whole mood has shifted. So, mm. I did order me some new press-ons, though. So, I'm excited about that. And I ordered them not knowing when I was gonna use them. I just ordered them because I just thought they were so cute. Let me actually just show you. Let me show you what ones I ordered. So the nails I ordered were the Glam Glamnetic Golden Touch Press-On Nails and they look so pretty. Ooh, the glare. Okay, y'all probably can't see it, but it's like gold drizzle at the top. They're like gold tips. It kind of looks like paint dripping, but they're so pretty. Got them from Ulta. $15. They're called the Golden Touch Press on Nails by Glamnetic. I'm excited for these though. They're so pretty. I just really hope the um, the nail part, like where the, the uh, nail bed is, I hope it's not too white. Cause sometimes when I get press ons, it be too white. Like I want it to be really clear, you know? So hopefully it's not too white looking cause they do look kind of white. And then the gold tips, but yeah. But I just wanted to kind of rant with y'all. <laughs> Hey y'all, I'm back. I took a shower. I'm sitting on the floor because we're about to open up some packages. I have packages at the door. Um, so we're about to open them up. This is the Kellogg Pastry Crisp. Brown sugar and cinnamon. I've never tried this one. I usually get the strawberry. So I wanna try it real quick before I open up these boxes. Mm. 
Kind of tastes like a gingerbread man cookie. Gingerbread cookie. That's good. It's actually really good. Mm. This one might be better than the strawberry. Kind of reminds me of a pop tart, but they are way thinner than pop tarts, look. and they're kind of crispy. They're good. I'm gonna start getting this one because I like it more than strawberry. Brown sugar cinnamon. Okay. Mm. Let me show you the sandals I got. They are from Steve Madden. Um, and I see. Target sells the same pair, but I didn't want, I wanted a different color. Steve Madden had this particular color slash style. Here's the box. Now I'm thirsty. Oh, oh, these are so cute. OMG. Look y'all. Look how cute. Okay. Some of you may think they're ugly. <laughs> I feel like with these, it's either they're cute or they're ugly. Literally no in between. But I love them. They're so pretty. They're like a tweed material. But yeah, Target has the same exact pair of sandal sandals. They have the black one and the white ones. But... Yeah, but they don't have this color or the tweed style. Oh, they're so cute. Let me see if they fit. I wear a seven, so we're gonna see. And it's Velcro. Let's see if they fit, y'all. Perfect. Oh, these are so Ooh, my toes are not done, but they are so freaking cute on my feet. Oh, these are, I like them. I like them with like jeans. Um, they're gonna be so cute with jeans, the distressed jeans that I have. Mm. I can wear these with a lot. A lot but I definitely envision them more but like jeans so I'm gonna have to go to Sephora and return an item because I did not know glow recipe was gonna send me PR and one of the products in this first off let me show you how it opens up this right here is the plum plump hyaluronic cream which i love and it also includes the plum plump hyaluronic serum but this is the cherry on top this is their new lip balm so i went ahead and ordered it on sephora because i didn't know they were going to send this to me in pr so i'm gonna take the one i purchased back since i got it in um in the mail here she is I kind of want to put a little on right now. It's easy to put my finger in products now because I don't have any nails. Okay, this isn't as soft as, oh, you have to really dig in it. I was about to say it's not as soft as the, as the Laneige 
Is this a sleeping mask or just a lip balm? Oh, it's a lip balm, gloss balm. It doesn't have a smell. I was thinking it was gonna smell like their other products, like the watermelon or, yeah, it doesn't have a smell. Very glossy though. Mm, very, very juicy and glossy. Kind of wish, since this is a lip balm, I kind of wish it came in like a squeeze tube. Or, I don't know. It's cute though. It's really cute. So I'm excited that they sent it over. Now I can just um, take the one that I purchased back to Sephora. But yeah, that's from Glow Recipe. And I got a few boxes that I don't even know what's inside. So let's see. This one says fragile. Ugh, and it's kind of heavy. Uh, 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 uh. Let me scoot y'all back some. Because the table is in my way. What's in here? What do we have? What is this? Oh, Cover Girl. Cover Girl sent me a package. What is this? <gasps> y'all. Is this an acrylic case? What is this? Oh, this is so cute. Oh man. It's eyeshadow, but it looks like it is broke. Oh, it's eyeshadow everywhere. How cute is this? Okay. I don't want to get anything on the carpet, but this is so cute. It's a, it's a little acrylic drawer. I'm struggling, y'all. have all of the oh my gosh oh y'all they have all of those glosses the um hold on one of the little handles is broken dang it it's ruining the aesthetic definitely gonna be using this all right finally got it out look at this y'all oh look at that i'm so sad about the, oh yes i can see the little piece down here i i have super glue so i'm just gonna and I also have a hot glue gun, so I'm gonna glue this together, this little piece right here. Cause this is just too cute. So freaking cute. I'm not gonna open this drawer because, actually I think this is, oh, these, this is one whole drawer. I thought these were like two separate ones. But this one has all the eyeshadow palettes in it. And these are the clean color, which I've already tried these palettes with you guys and like a get ready with me. And I wasn't the biggest fan of the formula, um, but one of them in here is broke because it's like eyeshadow everywhere. And then on the other side, we have these Perfect Point Plus eye pencils. Black, brown, navy blue. Yes, I do not have like a true navy blue eye pencil in my collection so I'm happy to have this um yeah so in the other colors it's like a gray and then like a lighter brown color cool all of those and then y'all these are some of the best 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 glosses these right here they gave me all the shades yes the yummy fresh clean what are they called the clean fresh yummy glosses these are the best so i have this one already it's called um no not this one which one do i have this one, coconuts about you this is the shade that i have already um and oh yeah i am so excited to have all of these i'm gonna try them 
And the ones I'm not going to use, I will, of course, just stash it in like a giveaway box. Um, but I'm excited to have those. And then we also have, what are these? Oh, a Clean Invisible Loose Setting Powder. Oh, they gave me all the shades, girl. Oh, we're going to have a time with this. I am very excited. And I, ugh, this acrylic drawer is just too... I just want to have this like in the bathroom put my skincare in it this is so cute okay i got another box that says fragile on it this one is really light though and it doesn't oh anastasia beverly hills okay i already know what's in here i already know because they have a new eyeshadow palette but why is the box so big it's really light so maybe they just put a lot of packing stuff in it i don't know but there is a new eyeshadow palette on the lock, so we are gonna see what it's all about. Oh, they included some lippies. Okay. Okay. Now let's open this box up. Looks like you open it up right here how cute look at the presentation y'all how freaking cute is that do i have any of these glosses i think i have oh no are these new shades this is a pretty one really pretty like soft baby pink what's it called guava okay let me show you the eyeshadow palette so y'all can see it. She's real cute. And here is the inside of it. I'm gonna fold it back like this. Very pretty. Y'all remember that Fenty Beauty eyeshadow palette? The, I think it was the Galaxy palette. The colors look very similar to that palette. Yeah, okay, I have another box here. This is, yeah, this is the last box. And I don't know who this one is from either. It just is Ulta Beauty, the Little Mermaid. So it might be from Physicians Formula again. Let me see. Look at this, y'all. <laughs> That's so cool. By the way, if you haven't watched The Little Mermaid yet, girl, I kind of want to go again. Oh, this, oh, the Black Girl Sunscreen. Yes. Yes. Okay, they have... Oh, and I got another... Um, Pacifica, is this a cleanser? Yeah, the face wash. So they already sent me that. I don't have the Black Girl, well, I do have the Black Girl sunscreen, but I don't have it in the um, Little Mermaid packaging. So cute. And then they also included, now I'm not gonna keep this stuff. I'm gonna actually probably give this to um, my friend's daughter. This is the, uh, what is this? Are these nail polish? Oh lip set these are so cute for um yeah she is gonna love these so i'm gonna give them to her and then i said now she doesn't wear makeup yet <laughs> i don't even know if she's gonna wear makeup like when she gets of age but um i'm still gonna give it to her because like for halloween you know this will be cute to have these little pearls I'm still gonna give it to her so yeah these are cute for her and then i'm gonna keep the black girl sunscreen and since i already have the face wash i don't even know if i'm gonna use it though but this is another product i'm just gonna give away since i already was gifted this so that is everything that was sitting at the door for today i'm excited about these y'all i love 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 these sandals I love them. Let's see. Some distressed jeans. Maybe like a bodysuit. And I can see me wearing the um, my little black Chanel um, with these. Oh, I'm excited. So like casual, cute on the bottom. And then the little Chanel purse will just kind of spice it up. It'll be so cute. I love, 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 love these. All right, y'all. We made it to Target. I'm going in there. I made me a little list 
this is one of those days I don't know if y'all remember but I was saying in one of my vlogs that um, I have a habit of not picking up the, or bringing the camera um, but I want to make it a habit to start like bringing the camera more picking it up and <clears throat> just taking you guys with me on just random outings like random errand outings you know so today was one of those days because I'm literally coming here to get a couple of things and leaving because it's very cloudy I think it's gonna rain today so I'm trying to beat the weather <laughs> but um, on my list I have hand soap paper plates Curology patches. I'm running out of those because um, Robert is using them too. <laughs> and deodorant. That's all that is on the list. That's all I'm going in here for. And yeah, <clears throat> so it's still pretty early. My voice is still kind of, you know, a little, a little crunchy, crass, crispy, graspy, raspy. <laughs> so yeah, let's go. are the Curology patches. I usually get them in my subscription, but I see that Target carries them, so might as well get them while we're at Target. So we need some hand soap. We need the refill hand soap instead of getting like the little small bottles. So I'm just gonna get one of these. Y'all, these refillable, refillable, reusable um, cotton wipes, cotton pads are good for taking off masks like the um, detox masks. I got that one, they have black. But they're really good to have if you're wanting to um, either use them with toner or just taking off your face mask. They're really good. I know I'm getting copyrighted for the music, but I just want to quickly tell you guys this random story. Um, is it a story? Random thing. Okay, every time I come in Target, I always see this notepad. It's like a, a little journal slash notebook. And I always see it on random aisles. Like today when I just got the paper plates, it was sitting on a shelf behind me. Just one journal, just randomly sitting there. So I told myself, I'm just gonna go to the journal aisle to see like the books, sketchbooks and stuff like that to see if it's there. And I see it, it's like a whole bunch of them. And I feel like I just need to go ahead and get it. It's this one right here. And y'all, <laughs> this is crazy cause it's my favorite color, it's pink, but it says faith can move mountains. And it's just like a little, um, a notebook. You can write anything you want in it. And I think this will be a good notebook to just write down prayers. Um, yeah, cause I don't really have like a prayer journal, like an empty journal to use. So I'm just gonna go ahead and get it. Cause I mean, why not? You know, every time I come in here, I see it randomly sitting on a shelf. So I feel like that's my sign to get it, right? Oh my gosh, and look at this y'all. It's a pouch, but look, there's a strap on the back where you can just connect it to or strap it on your book, whatever book you're using. I always lose my pens and stuff, so this is like genius. Like what? And it's pink. Y'all, get me out of this store, cause why am I coming across things that I feel like I would, you know, need and it's my favorite color? Like, should I get it? It's $10. I think I want it. I think I want it. Let's get it. So the deodorant that I um, get from here, they don't have any more. I get the salt air, um, salt air deodorant, the blue one, and they don't have any more of that. So I'm gonna go to Ulta to get some of the Truly deodorant that I use, and then. I'll be done. And Robert told me to get him a Coke, so I'm just gonna get one down here. All right, we are done. Headed to Ulta. 
Girl, not it rained while I was in there. I'm glad it did, because... I mean, I have a hat on and a hood if it does rain on me, but it rained, girl. We're going to go to Ulta and get um, that deodorant. They be, you know, slacking on that deodorant, but we're going to see if it's in there. And, um, and that's all I'm going in there for, okay? That is all I'm going in there for. I feel like it's still early. I think they're still close. Oh no, they're still close. Oh, I got a couple more minutes until they open. Okay, we can sit in the car. We about to go home for real. Just couldn't do it. All right, y'all, so I came home, took a shower. Now I'm about to refill this soap. I thought I didn't see a seal in here and I opened it. Oh, is that stuck at the top? just finished setting up my Bible I put these tabs in there and this is the she reads truth Bible and look at the pouch that I showed y'all earlier fits perfectly on there the little markers and then my new notepad so, yeah but yeah if you're wondering where I got my Bible it's from Amazon and the little tabs are from Amazon too and y'all saw where this was from and the little notepad that I also got from Tarjay but I want to quickly do a mini haul with you guys since I'm in here um we're just gonna quickly go through what I picked up at Ulta y'all saw I think I showed y'all what I got from Ulta um but initially I was going in there for the deodorant the truly deodorant got that and I saw they have a new body wash. And y'all know I'm a sucker for body care products. So um, it's the Brighten and Smooth Performance Body Wash. I'm gonna give that a try. Let's smell it. Ooh. It definitely doesn't smell like anything. Well, it says blueberry um, on it, but that doesn't smell like blueberry. It smells really clean and fresh. Maybe I can smell a little bit of blueberry in it, but it has vitamin C, AHA, blueberry, niacinamide, and vegan collagen booster in it. So it's supposed to be really good for the skin. And then, okay, so I'm going to go ahead and put these on probably after um, I do this haul. You guys will probably see it in the next vlog, but I just want to just go watch TV while I do my nails. So I'm going to put these on. Um, and they're the new ones. The ones that I used to wear had like a square tip, but these are round and they look really cute. So I'm just going to pop these on and, um, wear them for the week. And I saw the Halo Glow Beauty Wand from e.l.f. So every time I go in Ulta, that was all I got, by the way. Every time I go in Ulta, they 
um, are usually sold out of the deep rich ones. So I saw it and I figured I'd go ahead and get it. Um, okay. Sephora. So remember the other day I said that I got the glow recipe. This is the one I'm going to go ahead and return. I should have, well, no. Yeah, we'll just go another day. I was about to say I should have went today. But um, yeah, the Glow Recipe Lip Balm. I'm going to return this because I just got it in PR. Um, okay, so we're going to try this out, y'all. This is the Habit um, number 38 Mister. It has broad spectrum SPF 38. So this is a sunscreen spray. So I don't reapply sunscreen because... Like if I'm going somewhere, if I have makeup on, I don't want to mess up my makeup. Um, do I have anything in here? I have this. I don't want to mess up my makeup. So I figured I'd try out, this is a Buxom exfoliator, but I'm going to put it on because it kind of feels like a lip balm when you put it on. My lips are very dry. Forgot to put something on my lips after I took a shower. But yeah, I want to try out like a spray, a sunscreen spray. Um, and I figured we'd try this one out. Something to keep in my purse, you know. Ooh, I love the mist. It's so, so ooh. Oh, this smells so good and fresh. Cucumber. I think. Cucumber. I think I got the cucumber one. Yeah, cucumber. And smell the sunscreen in it too, but mostly the cucumber scent, which is good. But yeah, something to keep in my purse. Yeah, SPF 38. Hopefully my skin don't break out with it. So let us know if you tried anything from this brand. Let us know. Um, oh, some of the stuff I got um, online, I just threw everything in this little bag. But yes, girl, we gonna try out a sunscreen spray, just something to reapply on the face throughout the day. Oh, okay, I can already tell this is gonna give me that glow because it, def it definitely gives me a dewy, it definitely gives a dewy finish, so, which I like. Um, I really like the smell of it though. They have two more other scents, but the other ones were sold out, so I just um, stuck with that one. Makeup by Mario blush this is the new blush i got the shade perfect pink um this will be my first time opening this in person this is one of the products i ordered online let's see okay 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 i was actually worried that it was gonna be too light but this is a really pretty pink if i can get it open here this is the front of it mm -hmm. she's cute real cute Let's watch it. Mm hmm yeah, real sheer. She real sheer. I'm sure it's gonna look better with a brush when I apply it with a brush on my um my cheeks, but just rubbing it with my finger, I barely see anything. Oops. But we'll try it out on the face. We're gonna try it. Ooh, y'all, speaking of blush. I finally got the shade that I originally wanted. This is the Dior Rosy Glow, uh, Rosy Glow Blush in the shade Berry. So they have these online now. I got my other one in store, the mahogany one. But this is the shade I really, 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 really wanted. And y'all look at the color. It's so pretty, y'all. So pretty. So let me open it. The front of it looks different than when you open it up. But look, it's like the most beautiful violet purple slash I don't know it's so pretty though really really pretty so I'm excited to try that out and then I also grabbed oh okay was not going in there for fragrance girl I have I have enough perfume <laughs> I have more than enough but people are saying Miss Dior Bloom is better than the original Miss Dior the Bloom Bouquet they were like, girl, if you have Miss Dior, try Bloom Bouquet. You will not want to wear the original Miss Dior. So I finally, finally, finally smelled it in store. And y'all, I kind of wish this was my first Dior. 
fragrance purchase because now that I smell this, the other one that I have, I'm like, oh, uh, you might be sitting on the shelf for a while because this smells so, so, so good. So I just got the little roller ball because all they had was the full size and then this. And I didn't need the full size. Like, I really didn't need the full size. So, and the roller ball is really cute. She is real, real cute. But this is just so, mm, it's so clean and pretty and fresh and sweet. And, okay, here it is what it looks like. It's so good. It's so freaking good. And there's like the little ball right there. <sighs> Y'all, it smells so good. So much better than uh, Miss Dior, in my opinion. And some of you told me that anyway, so... Yeah, way better than the other Miss Dior fragrance. So, so glad I got this. So, so, so happy about it. And then I also got, um, as if I need any more, I should put this on. Yeah, I'm gonna put this on my lips. You're supposed to wipe off that buxom um, exfoliator anyway, so I'm gonna wipe it off my lips. So this is the new Tula Skincare Moisture Lip Mask. And this is what she looks like. So this is in collaboration with Krista Horton. Um, it's a coconut, uh, coconut overnight hydration lip treatment. But I'm going to put it on now. I've been wearing lip masks like lip balms anyway. So, okay, so it comes out clear. Oh, this smells good. It smells like a tropical vacation. Very coconutty. Mm -mm. feels good too very very smooth not sticky feels really good kind of like the summer fridays lip balm mm, it smells good too it doesn't have that sweet taste some lip products have a sweet taste to it this one does not but it feels good i like it I like it. And then the very last thing I got from Sephora, um, finally saw this on the shelf because this has been sold out for a while in my Sephora. This is the Kosas Plump and Juicy Vegan Collagen Spray on Serum. So I've seen a few girlies use this and I've been wanting to try it out for myself. I've tried it in store, like the little tester, but that was when, you know, they didn't have any more on the shelf. I've just been trying out the tester. I just put it on my hand, not my face. And I like how it feels on the skin. Like it gives me a glow, which I am all about the glow, y'all. Y'all know I've been loving the glowy skin. So yeah, this is how it looks. And you just spray it on your face. But I've seen the girlies use it in their skincare routine, their morning skincare routine. So I think this will be a cute little step to do for my morning routine. Is that my night routine? I have my night routine down pat, so I don't really wanna bother that so i'm just gonna you know use it for my morning routine or when i'm doing my makeup i don't know but i just wanted it i wanted to try it out for myself this has been sold out at my sephora they finally got a new shipment in but that's all i got y'all that is all i got that i wanted to share um i'm gonna end the vlog here can't even remember the last time i did like a outro on my vlogs but thank y'all for hanging out with me Thank you, thank you, thank you. It was a good week. It was a really good week. So hope y'all enjoyed. Thank you again for hanging out. And I will see you guys later.